Hey guys, welcome to another recipe. Actually, it's a what I eat in a week. But Sunday, I started off with a salad and leftover tofu fried chicken. And I put balsamic vinaigrette on top and ended up just eating in a wrap because for some reason, like I said, it's more satisfying. And then for dinner, we attempted to make the Aztec vegan spaghetti. Oh my god, I can't even like tell you how delicious this stuff is. Like this tofu crumble, bomb. I like literally kept eating it. I almost ate the whole thing. And then they asked for something else, but I only had mushrooms, but I love mushrooms, so I just threw that in. And then the sauce, like what made it meaty, like all these veggies that's pulled together, I didn't I did not expect it to be like this delicious. Like this is ten times better than just the regular stuff. I swear you need to try this and if you try it, please tag me if you have photos because I want to see it. It's not my recipe but it is seriously that good that I just want to salivate over your photos. <laughs> just look at that. Look how meaty it is. Ugh. Like I want to make it again this week. And then Monday, Ryan took me to lunch and we went to the Korean place and I got bibimbap while Ryan got tof not tofu pho. I had some leftovers when I got home and I gained some weight this week. And I had leftover pasta and I made um, avocado toast for lunch when I got home. Season as usual, garlic, salt, and pepper. And one of them, I used the leftover spaghetti sauce, and the other was just mashed avocado with furukake on the top. I don't know how to say it properly. Bia, let him know! When we went out for 4th of July, it was just, I had a lot of fried food, fries, tots, just everything. I hope you guys had a really good fourth. We went out and we just walked the docks, went into some places to listen to some music. And then Wednesday, we had to wake up early at 6 to be prepared for the parade. And this is just a little snippet of what we do. This is Etienne, this is what they do in the Philippines. Um, and this is our crowd pleaser song called Blackjack. If you can find me, I'll send you guys some Senegin stuff. Don't we sound good? Uh, we sounded so good. And my sister is so nice, she always gets me stuff. Um, she bought me vegan cream cheese, so I had a cheese bagel. And then after we visited my grandpa, we got froyo that was not vegan. It was hazelnut. It was delicious though. And then we after we went to my friend's house, Megan and Virgil's house, and had a barbecue. And I just had one of those Costco burgers, this delicious board. I know it's not vegan either. And then I picked berries in their backyard because they're fresh. And then a hot dog. Lots of food. <laughs> And then Thursday, I attempted to do the master cleanse. I've done it before. Um, when I was in college, I lasted like two weeks. The first three days, honestly, are the worst. Um, but after, it's like easy. But I did it last even probably four hours because we ended up going swimming at the lake and I got hungry, so I ate a hot dog. I couldn't help myself. When we got home, I just ate everything. Chips, leftover spaghetti, everything. And these apples with leeching in it. If you haven't tried it, it's the best. And then Friday, Ryan and I biked to the Thai restaurant, got pad thai and tofu curry. And then we went to watch um, a movie after with my family and I had a whole tub of popcorn. So this is what I'm going to be making for lunch today. I literally... I'm just trying to use food in the fridge so it doesn't go bad. Fettuccine noodles, a lot of garlic because I love garlic. This red pepper that was going bad. We have left a 
of this asparagus because it went bad, it was all wilted. It's a sad little piece of avocado and probably like, um, I don't know, would you say that's like a two cups of mushroom? And then um, celery. So this is all stuff going bad in the fridge and I'm just gonna put it in some nori sheets, like always. Thank <laughs> you.